Hi, I'm Jason Pancoast, Engineering Manager at Cap Inc. and I recently got to take a close look at what's coming in the new release of SolidWorks 2015. While it's still in beta, we're limited in what we can disclose publicly. For the best introduction to the new functionality, you'll really want to come to our launch event on October 17th. But until then, I'll try to share what I can. In the past, you may have noticed that a SolidWorks to improve performance size increases. While well, SOLIDWORKS 2015 includes technology to automatically your size up to 2x. You don't have to do anything to turn it on. Just open your and it in the Some of the best enhancements are with There's a brand new type of called a This will let you do anything you want to in terms of making When you choose a to you put your into it and you use the to control how to make each one different. Another enhancement that industrial designers will especially appreciate is what they've done for SolidWorks introduced last year, which let you using a instead of the old fashioned way, which was often hard to control. But you had to choose whether to the old way or the new way. Now in SolidWorks 2015, you can back and forth from an old-fashioned into a at any time. I mentioned small improvements as well. You probably have a list of things you would like to see them do. Let's see if SolidWorks 2015 lets you check off anything on your list. Want to be able to from its get off. And if you need to make a rectangle with but you've been doing it manually for years, now SOLIDWORKS 2015 can do it for you. Check it off. Ever tried to have relationships by being on the between two entities? Check it off. So if you want to see any of this new be sure to come to our launch event October 17th.